Alright, uh, guys, welcome back to more Ghost Recon Breakpoint. I've just kind of been taking my time with this game. We're currently... I just put the XP buff on, by the way. Uh, we're currently done with... We just take. We just took out Silverback in the last video, which I actually... I was hoping it'd be like a cutscene. You go into a room, and then it's like some Metal Gear Solid type stuff. You know, like him and Liquid Snake and Revolver Ocelot, that kind of stuff. Where it's like, have at you, Snake, and they go after each other. But uh, it was just a normal enemy. You just kill him. I'm gonna guess Rosebud's kind of the same thing. Uh, I'm gonna go ahead and continue the main story though as far as like these missions down here. Uh, I feel like I guess I'll do Paula's first and then I'll finish up with Carl's missions. So let's see what she has right now. So right now we're supposed- we already did one for her which I think I- remember I took a break from Christina's missions and then went and did one of the hers like I think like early on in the game. So all right restricted area one find Madeira. Uh, let's see. Paula is missing uh, based on latest information held by Sentinel in restricted area 01 province. Scala is still waiting for her to be brought back. Okay, so we're going to go get her. My guess is the way this mission is going to work is uh, I probably go get her <laughs> and I have to escort her out. So let me see if I can upgrade any of my stuff really quick. I don't want to spend too much time on like the Shop and all that. I just I should have whatever you oh, need. Oh, better pistol. Let me go and ahead maybe and grab a few things that. You didn't know you needed. All right, nice. Let's see. If I'm not mistaken, what we'll probably have wind up happening is yeah, I don't think I have anything better. Uh, I'm just gonna keep those for now. I'll sell everything later on. They need like a sell all button. But all right, I did the little campsite. I got What's the ten percent XP boost. Uh, we're good on everything else. Oh, I fact I think the faction stuff. I did mess around with a faction They're mission just while I was in. by myself. Uh, but other than that, the game's just been I just been honestly like waiting to record it before I play it. So it's like I don't really like to play this type of game. At first I thought maybe I'll be leveling up in between videos, but it's not like Borderlands or Assassin's Creed Odyssey was where I had to really like level up before I could continue the story. Uh, this game just you know, the game kind of gives you what you need as you go if you loot all the chests and on top of that. Uh, it's not too bad. So, actually, let me see where we're going because Restricted Area 01 is... That's a data farm. That's something else. It'd be down here, right? Yeah. Uh, is there like a thing next to it? Oh, there is! Here we go. Let's just do this. That'd be a lot faster, I feel like. Alright, garage. We'll go ahead and get the helicopter. I know you can get other helicopters and stuff, but I just find like this is the easiest way to play the game. Uh, so, this is kind of what I'm doing right now. We're gonna fly over here. We're probably gonna have to interrogate a few different people. The way this game's mission structure is, uh, we're gonna go there and interrogate. Alright, let's see what we got. Oh, the helicopter's over there. Oh, I think I, yeah, the XP boast. Did it go away with the interface? Yeah, it does. Okay. But yeah, I, I was looking at, like, the fastest way to level up my gear, because I really just want to finish the main story, but I think, honestly... I'll be doing all these extra missions anyways. Uh, but what I'll most likely do is... Probably for the last couple of parts... Which I don't know how much more we got of this game left. But for the last several videos, I'll most likely do like super long videos. Uh, oh, there's a skill point down there. But I don't want to get anywhere near that. Oh, so you're right. Right now, if you see this, you see these little smoke stacks in the distance? I'll fly over to this one really quick before we go down there. Uh... This, if you get near it, it's just a little camp thing I was just at. It'll put it on the map. I thought you could only get the information from those by uh, interrogating people, right? But watch it. I'll put this on the map when I get near it. And then I can always like use it as a fast travel point. So, look at that. There it is. That's so, that's so much easier. I honestly just want to fly around and just do that. So, Alright, getting in here is not going to be that hard, I don't feel like. Because <clears throat> we could come back through... Looks like over here would be the best entrance point. It's going to be a lot of stuff in here, I feel like. Maybe a skill point. I thought I saw like a blueprint weapon thing in there. Uh, I think I would have went crazy with this game. Like, as far as like playing it every single day. I've been doing like one part a day here here and there. I mean, like, I'm not, I'm not even really uploading too much. But uh, I will be finishing it. I just think I was like, you know what, if I rush through this game, I'll have like a couple of weeks where I don't have anything to play. And I always like to just kind of have consistency on my channel, so... Oh wait, hold on. I saw the funniest meme the other day on like Reddit, I think it was, where they had uh... 
I think it was like a Chris Farley movie. I know he passed away and all that, but it was where he was like going down the hill. Oh god. He was like going down the hill and he was just rolling and rolling and rolling. And it's like somebody posted saying in Ghost Recon is what it feels like. Hold on, let me just get some scan action going. Actually, I don't think this is a restricted area. Oh, no. Oh, that's funny I just said. It is. It's called Restricted Area 01, Brad. Come on, no. I, I meant, like, I don't think there's going to be too many enemies here. Because I see a lot of civilians so far. Probably going to be a few, though. Let's see. Or it could just be the average amount. That's funny. I just I said, I don't think it's a restricted area. Go to Restricted Area 01, Brad. Oh, here we go. There it goes. Yeah, like, I'm able to just walk around. I, I don't know. I guess you just talk to civilians. So maybe it's called restricted area, but it's not like an actual restricted area. Does that make sense? I don't know. Probably not. I think this chest is upstairs. Let me go up there. Yeah, man, I don't know what it is. It's like getting colder now, which I'm happy for because my trees aren't dying anymore. Uh, but it's like the... Man, it's just... This time of year, I love it. I love ha Halloween. I love the fall weather. It's just been an incredible... Um, how do you say it? It's just been an incredible experience to... Every year, be able to, like... You know, do this kind of stuff for you guys. And just be able to actually enjoy, like, this weather with my dogs and stuff. I don't know. Just fun. So, thank you guys for supporting me over all this time. I've been playing this and Destiny 2 a lot. I know that... I think I'll go pretty ham once, uh... Call of Duty drops, Death Stranding, the new Star Wars game. We'll be playing all those all the way through. And Do Doom Eternal got pushed back. I was kind of surprised about that. Which, I mean, whatever. For the best. Oh, right, hold on. We got some... I mean, there was some civilians, like, right back over here, wasn't there? Can I just ask one of them? I'll mark this person over here, unless there's somebody else I can talk to. Let me see something really quick. I just want to saw like people walking around unless they're not I really got to get my drone out for this Hold on, let me just We do have a few enemies Like this guy right here Um, all right Let's See what we got Yeah, it's, so it's just kind of few and far between Oh, there's a drone Always watching there's some enemies. Okay. This is where the restricted area part comes into play, I guess. Only problem is I don't think we're going to be able to ask any of them. When they have to have an eye icon over it before we can get information. I don't know how that really works, but whatever. <laughs> Solar panel roofing. That's got to be so expensive. Uh, I guess I'll just scan the area as much as I can. I don't see anybody. It just says civilians must know where she is. I don't know if that means I got to interrogate one. I'm pretty sure it does. I have a feeling it's going to be a civilian. I bet this guy has an eye. Nope. Neither of them. Okay. Must not be killed. Well, it's kind of a given, I guess. Oh, yeah. I appreciate you guys. The first video for this series did really well. I think we're close to 2 million views. I, I just think it's crazy, man. Like... No matter what game I play, it's like, I to have you guys support me has been, it's just been awesome, because I never thought I would have this, you know. I'm about to level up off just some scanning. Hold on, these two guys right there, okay. Those little bots, whatever these are, uh, drone patrolling, yeah. Those are from Watch Dogs 2, I remember those, uh, they'd be at some of those houses, because I think that game took place, was like in San Francisco or something? I can't remember the city. All right, I don't see any civilians that have an eye. Unless there's, like... I mean, this person right here, maybe? No? Nobody has an eye. Who am I supposed to interrogate? Let me kill this person really quick. Hold on. Oh, wait, hold on. Ooh, let's get that suppressor on, Brad. Uh, does this one not have it? Just put it on really quick. All right, we're good. Ooh, that was close. I was trying to get my sensitivity right, because I was, like, messing around with the sensitivity earlier, and, uh... 
yeah, it's just you kind of, when I stop playing this game for a couple of days, I have to kind of get back in the groove. Here's what I'm wondering. There's a chest over there. I'm not going to stop at every chest, but if it's kind of near me, I'll just get it anyways. Alright, item full. Oh, I did buy a bunch of syringes and stuff. Let's see what we got in here. Alright. See how high this is. Oh, it's down one. Okay. Uh. Oh, I bought some more of the sink shot if I need it. But I shouldn't need it right now. Of course, I... Got a bunch of resources there now. Okay, we got... Oh, there's somebody above us. Okay, yeah, there's a... It's funny, I was looking for somebody and I couldn't find... I just need somebody with an eye. And here we are. Or oh, there's probably not even that. It's probably a uh, computer. Like information. Investigate. Hold on. It says civilians must know where she is, but... Yeah, okay. Man, so I really gotta interact with somebody. Sounds terrible. Let's do some bench press. What are they rocking right now? That's incline bench. That's a 45. Uh, looks like a 25 and a 10. What is that? 45 plus the bar. 90, 135. Plus 50, plus 20. I can't do math. Whatever. It's a lot for incline. I've been trying to work out more, actually. I, uh... I don't... I do, like... It's weird I'm not, like, playing football or anything, but I do, like, a football-type workout, like, deadlifts. Uh, dumbbell curls, preacher curls, back reps, uh, bench press for sure. Please leave me alone. I don't know what to do here. Do you know any information, sir? No? Alright, don't mind me. Alright guys, I scanned the area again. I found a civilian down here, it looks like. If I can get to him, hold on. Oh, how convenient. Hello. I'm looking for a scientist named Paula Madeira. You got any idea where I could find her? That's the information I remember. I was hoping you could help me with some more information. That's everything, I swear. Thanks. See you around. Alright, let's see what we got. Main missions, unread intel. That kind of took a lot longer than I expected. It seemed like half an hour. Uh, alright. She's in the R&D Center Omega. She's south of Freeman Residence in Devil Forest. She is near Blackburn Ridge in the restricted area 01. What is that, to the bottom left, maybe? All right, we're good. Uh, let me go ahead. So we got the information. Let me just... I'm right next to the area, but I just wanted to just make sure I got everything else. I feel like it's going to be a tough little section. I, I don't know what's going to happen, though, but, like, I feel like once we finish these missions and then we finish the other guys, I mean, there's only, like, so much you can really do in this game, I feel like. So, the faction stuff doesn't really intrigue me as much as I thought it would. I tried a few of the missions, and it's not... They're kind of like these, I guess. But it's, like, it's not, like, overly difficult. But it's just more to gain the rewards from, like, the battle pass type thing they have. As I fall and take serious exhaustion and healing damage there. All right, we're good. All right, it's flat out of here. Let's get the hell out of here. All right, one point three. Here we go. You get there quick. If I was to go on foot, it would take forever. All right, so I think once we find her, I'm gonna guess that. I mean, I honestly just want to get spotted immediately so I can kill everybody. But I don't know what, like, how tough this is going to be. There's a little trail right here. I'll just kind of go down here and... Oh, shit. Hold on. <laughs> let, me just, let me just take it easy there. Hold on. They heard a suspicious noise, but they didn't see my helicopter somehow. So I'm about to run up here. I'll follow this little trail right here, and then I'm going to just start picking people off. Let me, uh, let me get some XP first, though. I do have a skill point, but I'm saving my skill points right now. Uh, oh, that's a drone operator. Let me take them out. I don't know if all the drones in the area get taken down if you take out the drone operator. Or if it's like, just, uh... Come on, peek out of here. Uh, oh my god. I can feel it.
Now I just gotta stop this guy from... Okay, we're good. I used to be afraid of the big guys. Why can't I hop over this? There we go. Used to be afraid of the big guys, but it's like they're not really that difficult now. Somebody almost spotted me. Hold on. I'm gonna like run and dive right here. I feel like we've been here before. Alright, those two right there. So they have information. Location added to the camp. Oh, wait, that's her! I'll be damned. Alright. Now we have a few options here. We can, uh... I might take, I might use a sink shot and take out some of these guys on the roof. The two mortar guys, for sure. Uh... I think when I get to the end game, I'll probably use, like, a sniper build. Honestly. It just seems to be the best thing. We got that as well. Okay. Any snipers in this? I mean, what else do we have in here? A lot of enemies. And civilians. So I don't really care about all the little things right here. There's another drone operator, okay. Uh, at least, I think I went into the best possible spot for this, uh... Section and the fact that we've already found her we don't have to really do anything, you know what I'll do uh, Let's see. Let's take off the lure thing. I bought six of these just for you know a rainy day And it's not raining yet, but it's about to All right, here we go. Um Alright, I'm tempted to just go ahead and detonate these. Alright, there we go. Alright, nice. Let's go in. It's like I grab this chest really quick. Uh, so that took out the mortars and stuff. We do have to worry about the little drone on wheels up here. But I don't think it'll be too bad. Scale credits, nice. Am I missing something? Because there's a lot of red right here and I didn't see many... Enemies to the left over here, unless I just missed them. I was in this building right here. But we're not really going to be messing with this, I don't think. Oh, the turret. I don't know if the turret can spot me or not. Alright, there's the drone thing right there to the right. If I sneak in... There's somebody over there too, let me just mark them. I wonder why this gun is like third person and the other gun's not. It's kind of off. Alright guys, whatever. Let's just go in here. If I get spotted, I get spotted. I don't think it can see me. almost spotted me guys <laughs> all right if there's anybody up there with her I might get spotted but I'll have to just take them out Those quick I would imagine she has some kind of protection right I'm just gonna just walk straight to her Maybe we get lucky, I don't know. Who the hell are you? My name's Nomad. You were building drones for Walker and Stone? I... I, I was arrested for protesting. They made me work. Making war machines is the last thing on my to-do list. Yeah, well, a lot of people weren't sure what happened to you. Let's go. 
I'm sure more trouble's on the way. How'd you find me? Daigoro Ito. Stone said the outcasts were all dead. Not all of them. What do you know about Stone? How should I know anything? Uh, he seemed to know Cole Walker pretty well. They were best frenemies, know what I mean? Yeah. Yeah, I think I do. I just can't decide where I'd rather be. Blistering cold or this shithole or that rancid heat. Humidity down in Bolivia. Uh, Bolivia. Any day of the week. <laughs> you know, I, uh, I got this buddy, Stone, from the Rhett teams. He, uh, he set up his own shop doing contract work down in Mexico. He says down there the weather is sweet and women are soft. Yeah, what's the Rhett team? Retaliation teams. Super secret squirrel shit. I thought we were super secret squirrel shit. <laughs> Not like me and Stone and the other two bruisers on his team. Hang on. Three targets coming out of the building, 12 o'clock, they have rifles. Ready. 325 meters. Roger that, 325. Hold center. Send it. Targets down. I don't know about contract work. Tell me that when you have two daughters headed to college. <laughs> now look at that. One unlucky fella still squirming. Misery loves company. There's an asshole hanging out the doorway trying to give him a hand. Hold center. Send it. <laughs> Target's down. Yeah, I don't know about old Mexico. You know, me and Stone, we, uh, man, we never got along too good anyhow. Hey, you didn't fart in my rack, did you? How's it going? Yeah, it's been quiet. <sighs> Wake me up if uh, things get thrilling. I first heard about Stone a while ago. Shit. Are you one of Walker's men? One of his wolves? No. Look, let's get out of here first, then we can talk. I'm not leaving the factory if it's operational. Stone is scary enough without lethal drones. You got any ideas? I've been working here 15-hour days for months. I've thought a lot about blowing up the building. I've been preparing for this. I built a jacker to overload my energy cells in case they fell into the wrong hands. Just hook up this device, and I've programmed it so that once you're out of range, they will implode. 